Hello guys and a really really big welcome back to my channel. Happy New Year to everyone. By the time this goes up we're going to be well into January but this is the first Monday of the new year. It is 2020. What the? What is going on? I cannot believe it's 2020 but I really hope everyone had such an amazing Christmas. I'm sitting by the radiator because I'm literally so cold but I really hope everyone had such an amazing Christmas. I've had such a lovely time. I have done nothing. I've not worn makeup, I've not got ready, I've not done anything apart from like eat and watch loads of Netflix and it's been amazing. But I'm back today, I'm back at the salon this morning, I've got a lesson and I just thought I would vlog this week. I haven't got loads going on but just thought I would vlog it. I want to do loads more vlogs as well this year and I'm going to continue to not wear makeup and not brush my hair today because... I can't be asked, but yeah, I'm gonna do a little bit of skin stuff and I'm so happy. Santa very kindly got me my Charlotte Tilbury Magic Cream. Now, if you watch my videos, you know this is literally my all time favorite moisturizer. I ran out a few months ago and normally I get one for Christmas, so I thought it's a bit pricey, so I'm gonna wait and see if dear mum and dad get it for me and they did so thank you so much i'm literally these are my favorite and i also got the charlotte tilbury eye cream as well which i'm super excited about so i'm just going to apply some of this now this cream is like oh, this is just the best moisturizer in the entire world i've got really sensitive skin you know what i did a skincare video how to get clear skin and I feel like I curse myself a bit because my skin has just not been that good since it's got really cold but I did say in the video it always happens like when there's a change in the weather I can break out a little bit and I did um it's actually fine now but when I tell you I had the biggest spot I don't even know what it was it was like another head and I'm not exaggerating like you can kind of see the mark it's like somewhere here <laughs> it was New Year's Eve and I don't ever really wear makeup when I'm doing when I'm at work I can't really be bothered but yeah I didn't have makeup on and I kept catching a glimpse of myself throughout the day and I was like it was getting worse and worse and worse <laughs> bigger and bigger but it wasn't just like a normal like spot it was like it wasn't even a spot with a head that you could like squeeze or anything. It was like a lump. I looked like I hit my head off something. And, like from the side, it came out. I'm not even exaggerating. It came out. Like my whole forehead was like pushed forward. I wore like a beanie hat for four days because it was terrible. It was so bad. I was like, what is going on? I'm gonna go to work and then I'll speak to you guys after. <laughs> what I've done for like ages since I've been doing YouTube I haven't had like somewhere permanently set up to film I've always had like an area where I would film but I'd have to like put everything away set it up it was just annoying because I just needed somewhere to whoa why did that just happen then <laughs> that is too close that's so weird I could just I could just see my face getting like bigger and bigger anyway um so I have made my old room at my mum and dad's kind of into like my office-y workspace. My bed used to be like here and I've shoved everything to one side. I'm still keeping it like as my room and everything um, for when I'm here. But yeah, this is like my workspace, my new backdrop. I can't speak my new backdrop. I am so buzzing. So I've got this desk. Um, I think it was from like Wayfair or something. I'm not sure. So I got this desk and then this chair is from The Range. It's just a plastic chair and I got like a sheepskin um, 
like rug to go over it because I found a beautiful chair with all like sheepskin, like all fur, it was gorgeous. It was like 400 quid and I was like, no thanks. So this chair was like 40 pound and then I just put that over it. It's really comfy. And then all my little bits on here, I've got my secret. This is what I'm gonna have my makeup brushes in when I film. Um, I've got my camera stand. This is from, I think it's from Asda. Good old Aldi candles, which are Jo Malone dupes. If you saw my Primark haul, that's from Primark. My little Miss Hinch book. Um, yes, yeah, so I really am happy with this. Uh, so basically this is where I'm gonna be filming and then editing. I'm gonna have this as like my work area, but what I'm gonna do is I've ordered some shelves. They come in tomorrow. In I've ordered three, so I'm gonna have like one, two, three here, I think. I don't know about having them both sides. I'm not sure, what do you think? But yeah, three here. I've got like fashion books, which I got for Christmas, which I'm gonna have on there. So like fashion books, and I have a candle on there, some fairy lights. When I am sitting here filming, I'll have my light and everything set up. I've got a table here to put all my makeup on, my camera stand, and then I think, I'm thinking here I'll have some shelves so I can like display things so it just looks a bit nicer and then maybe some like fairy lights in the background. What do you think? At least that way it's just set up, it's a cute little backdrop, set up, I can have my light out, my camera out, I can just have everything like set up. And then I'm getting rid of these because I just feel like I've had them for years now and I want it to just be a bit more grown up so I ordered some prints. So we've got a Prada one. I got good vibes only and then a Coco Chanel. I love these. So I'm just going to get really simple, thin white frames. Is that nice? <laughs> Guys, what is this? Come here. Come on. Come in, come on. <laughs> uh. So I'm just gonna make myself a coffee now. I feel so tired. I was just driving back then and my eyes are like going, I feel so tired. So I'm gonna have a coffee. Uh. So I'm trying to healthy eat and this is what the situation is. Like, this is my problem. Okay, so I'm gonna Netflix and chill for a little bit. I've watched so much Netflix over Christmas. I have recently watched don't fuck with cats that I cannot even I mean what was that about I also watched um the Irishman it's like a three and a half hour film but I watched it because what else is there to do over Christmas I watched it it was really good I really liked it I love films like that like Goodfellas is one of my all-time favorite films um so yeah that is a really really good good film i loved that also i've just finished watching um 60 days 60 days in wait what's it called 60 days yeah 60 days in that was unreal i watched that literally over like two days i swear to god like i started it like at like four in the afternoon and i watched it up till like 2 a.m and then i watched it all the next day it was so good um if you haven't watched that i would so recommend to watch it a few people told me about it and i absolutely loved it got you which i just fucking hate i'm sorry if i don't know how people enjoy this i watched the first um series of it it was so boring i'm not even gonna bother watching the second one i know what happened someone told me but i just don't like it and i just see him as dan from gossip girl and i just hate it i find it so boring I really want to watch this Kevin Hart documentary. It's meant to be very good. Um, I really want to watch that. 
what else the witcher i've heard good things about but i'm not really into um kind of fantasy it's a bit like game of thrones i don't really like that i did start to watch the people versus oj simpson because i have never watched anything about the oj simpson trial i actually wow i'm so zoomed in still keep zooming in myself yeah i never knew anything about the oj simpson trial like he was kind of um like they said he murdered his wife but i never knew the ins and outs so i thought i want to actually watch something so this one's called the people versus oj simpson but it actually acts out um like what happens and i want to watch more of like a documentary on it so i'm gonna have a look on netflix for that because i think they have a few things oh, i've literally been crying that onion has just made my eyes water so bad and some dinner i'm gonna do like a like a prawn and chickpea curry kind of thing i don't know what to call it but it's just got onion some peppers i'm gonna put in some spinach fresh tomatoes can of chopped tomatoes chickpeas some prawns that i've been defrosting asparagus loads of like spices so yeah that is what i'm gonna do Hello, so it's Tuesday, um, it's about 10 o'clock in the morning, I'm just going to go and get my nails done now, um, yeah, I'm going to go and get them done, because this one snapped, I'm just going to get, I always get the same, I'm very boring, but I literally just always get the same nails, just some quick, I think I'm going to go a bit shorter, and I feel like, no, I've had this colour now like five times in a row, I always used to get gel, but they just don't last on my nails, so I get acrylics, but yeah i don't know i feel like being a bit crazy and going for like a white or something so crazy but no i'll probably just keep it this color to be fair it's just easy and it goes with everything but yeah i'm gonna get do all that and then i'm gonna go back and i've got to film today i've got loads of filming to do so i'm just back from getting my nails done i went for a bit of a pinkier color really pushed the boat out guys really pushed it out but yeah really like them got them done and then just got some gel done on my toes i've just had bit of lunch and then I'm sitting down now to film so I'm gonna film like a get glam with me because I feel like I haven't done like a proper like full glam makeup tutorial on my channel um so yeah I'm gonna film that and then I'm gonna do my best of um like 2019 makeup and I've just had some ink come from Zara so I'll show you that and also my shelves are here you know I told you about getting this little backdrop done so yeah my shelves have arrived um, so I'm going to have a look at them after. But yeah, I'm just going to sit down to film now. Oh, I just love now I've got like my desk, I've got my light, I've got my stand. The current situation is, um, yeah, so it's all kind of laid out now. But I am going to get um, a glass. So like on here, I've got like a glass topper. Um, and I'm going to get one of them put on here because it's just literally going to get ruined in makeup. So I've just popped my makeup on just like a um, notebook thing at the minute because i don't want to get makeup all over it so i just got the new dyson i think this is when you know you're officially an adult when these things make you excited this tells you like the time and everything Wednesday. Sorry, I didn't vlog much yesterday. We had our friends, had our friends come around on the night. Um, so yeah, just I was with them last night, so I didn't really vlog anything. Um, but today I am um, I'm just having a cup of tea. I'm gonna go and do some editing, and then I'm popping out to see my friend. The girl is joining the gym today. I'm meeting my friend at the gym at five. I'm joining the gym. And then tonight I'm just going to like edit, chill, I don't feel like I've got that much to do. <sighs> Can't be a good cuppa. So I'm just in bed, just editing some stuff. Got a cuppa, how cute is this mug?
So yeah, the other day <clears throat> I bought this book. I've been trying. I won't really want to read more this year, um, and I love like my little positive books. I got this. Good vibes, good life by Vex King. Because I love books like that. So yeah, just having a bit of a chilled morning. into like the cutest little Italian um, bistro for lunch. It was so nice. I've never been there before. It's like this little independent, cute, like, oh my God, it was amazing. Had like a fresh pizza that they cooked in front of us. Diet is going very well, as you can imagine. And now I'm not even going to the gym tonight, which I was meant to be, but yeah, I'm not doing that now tonight. Um, but oh my gosh, let me just show you what I've got. This bruschetta. <gasps> I've just got it for my dad because Honest to God, if you could get on the smell of this, the smell of garlic is like, oh my car stinks of it. And I really want to eat it myself because it looks so beautiful. But like, I'm just going to taste garlic for days. Also, from Zara. The other day. And the queue was so long to try on, so I just didn't try them on, but they were too small for me, so I've had to get the bigger size. These, like, cream leather leather trousers, so nice. Yeah, these were $19.99. I'm going to do, like, a recent clothing haul, so these will be in there. And my shelves have arrived from Ikea, which I'm really excited about. Like, literally, all the mud on this, I've just thrown it over the gate. And there could have been, like, anything in here, like glass or whatever. And I just threw it over, like, the gate onto the floor. So, here are my shelves. So I'm back now, I'm just going to edit my video, I'm going to really try and get it up tonight, but it is 20 to 6, so I don't know, I'm going to really try and get it up tonight. Um, but yeah, I'm in Manchester tomorrow, I've got a shoot with JD. Yeah, I don't know how much, I can't really film when I'm on shoots to be honest, because I have to just be like on the go and I can't really be like fiddling with my camera and yeah. I don't really know how much I'll be able to film tomorrow, but I will do as best as I can. But yeah, I'm just going to chill, edit, have some dinner in a bit. Um, yeah, I have just edited my video. I'm just waiting for it to upload now and hopefully I'm going to be able to get it on to YouTube. So yeah, um, I am so buzzing. Come out on Sky and I am so buzzing. I've just got this. I've wanted to see this for so long. Um, it's Hustlers with Jennifer Lopez. Yes, I'm just going to watch this tonight. I'm really, really excited. So I'm going to sit down. Um, I'm going to be like stop and start in it because I'm going to put that on YouTube when, when it's finishing, when it's finished loading. But yeah, I'm going to start this film and <gasps> I'm so excited because I wanted to go and see it in the cinema. I just never got around to doing it because J-Lo just looks like banging in this i mean she's like what 50 something and she's just friggin insane and i literally love her so yeah i'm so excited So this is really making me regret my pizza, my chocolate brownie, my four Jaffa cakes that I've eaten and not joining the gym today. <laughs> she literally is incredible. So I just had a shower. Um, did you see that? The light keeps flickering and it's never done that. That is really weird because my 
bedside light has been flickering and I've just put the main light on to film this and that's just gone off. That's really weird. I need to go to sleep soon. Um, as I'm off to Manchester tomorrow. Um, so yeah, just going to edit a little bit of this and then I'm going to go to sleep as I'm quite tired. That film was so good, by the way. I would recommend it so much. Like, I didn't think it was going to be as good as it was. Um, but it was actually really, really, really good. So that was Hustlers. Um, and, oh my God, Jennifer Lopez was just unreal in it. She was amazing. <laughs> now from Manchester I had a really good day shooting um I actually did prop my phone up and I managed to film a little bit um I couldn't do much but I just filmed a few like things when we were shooting the accessories and um, like the bags and stuff so yeah I will have inserted that but I'm just back now um I'm just gonna edit my video for like half hour and then I'm off to Miller and Carter for some food I'm literally starving so yeah cannot wait to have some food and then tomorrow um i'm going shopping in the morning because i need to return some something at zara i need to get some more coffee pods from the nespresso shop i need to get a diary for work because i haven't got one of them for this year yet um what else do i need to get tomorrow a few little bits of makeup for the weekend um i cannot wait for a nice steak i'm starving I don't know what's even wrong with me today. I literally have no energy. Like, oh my god. I just feel so like... Drink my hot water and lemon. I'm gonna get changed, uh, and then I'm gonna go hit the shops.
guys, so it is now Monday. I've actually been really shit and I haven't even vlogged the weekend. Um, I forgot my camera on Saturday and I was actually at the salon all day and then I was out all day yesterday so I wouldn't have been able to film hardly anything anyway so I just thought I would not film the weekend and then um, carry on filming today just for another two days. But yeah, I had a busy day Saturday at the salon, had some lessons in and then Saturday night I literally just chilled. Um, I was out all day yesterday and then Love Island started last night. So today I've just... Um, just literally got ready i need to go to the post office and i need to join the gym yeah that's on my list i'm going to join the gym and i've got loads of clothes to sort through we need to go to the charity shop and what else do i need to do today sit paul oh. so i am now So I am now a member of a gym. I'm having to hold a toy, she's gonna jump at me in a minute. So she's so crazy, this dog. She's gonna launch. Oh. <laughs> Just let me speak for one minute because you're too noisy. Wait. So yeah. I went and I joined a gym today. Another resolution ticked off, but um, but yeah, I actually have to go now. So, oh, so, so yeah, I joined the gym today. Um, I'm actually like a member from tomorrow, which is really exciting. And and they have um, a cafe there. They do food there and coffee, so that's what I'm most excited about. Um, but yeah, I had a look at all the timetable and it looks so good. Sorry. It looks so good. Um, the, they do yoga loads. They do Pilates. They've got so many um, lessons. It's actually quite a big gym. It's one thing that I really wanted to do this year, what I really wanted to start was yoga and pilates and they they do that <laughs> oh my god I've got the naughtiest dog ever you're so naughty on the blog those are classes which is so good and I'm going to try so hard to actually put effort in because I just don't have a clue about the gym like I actually don't and I always start it, I have every intention and then I just give up. So I'm really gonna try hard. I've got some personal training sessions that I booked in as well. And also my friend goes, so I think, you know, we're gonna we're gonna motivate each other. And also the classes. Um, I feel like when you book a class, you because you have to like book them online. So I think if you book yourself into a class, it's a bit like, okay, I kind of need to go. Um, yeah, and yoga is something I really, really wanna do this year. So actually I'm excited about that. I don't know when my first day is going to be. I feel like I need to go with her first because I'm going to be a bit scared. Hello guys, good morning. So it is Tuesday today. Um, yeah, I thought I'd just come on here and kind of end the vlog. Um, I'm just doing loads of filming today and then tomorrow I'm off to Manchester for a shoot. So... Yeah, I thought it'd be a good time to kind of end it here. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you want to see more of these little vlog videos. Um, but yeah, thank you so, so much. And please be sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next video.